Hello everyone. Welcome back to BTNX Learning. Today we will be seeing how to use statistical function in Excel and we will be using ChatGPT to drive the program. Okay. Imagine you are in a situation that you need to calculate a data analysis. Okay. In Excel, there are a lot of uh, statistical functions and statistical formulas, but you should know how to execute it. Right. It will take some time to understand. But if we ask ChatGPT, okay, it will give you the basic step by step guide. Okay. So let's uh, enter into the part. If you are someone using Excel in your day to day job, let me tell you something you are going to be replaced unless you are integrating AI in your Excel. If you integrate AI in your Excel workflow, let me tell you something you are going to be 10x more productive and you, you will be getting that promotion that you deserve. If you want to learn all this, join me for my two hours workshop on Excel using AI. So here is the uh, Excel sheet. Okay, I have basic uh, details okay like uh, these are the values like score is there okay and uh, we have score and here okay i have given the values what it should come so based on this uh, values from a2 to a8 i need to find the mean of these value score into here median into here and mode into here okay and i'll explain later what is mean median mode as most of them are aware but i am i'll be explaining okay our chat gpt will explain okay so let's go to the chat gpt here is the chat gpt now i have attached that excel sheet whatever the data we have seen i have attached the excel sheet and i will be uh, prompting Attached sheet above, it I'll give. Well, okay. And column A. Yes, here is thing, right? Column. Okay. It has values from A2 to A8. Okay. Four values. A two to eight. Okay. Using Excel formula option, how to find? We need to find mean at b2 median at b3 uh, mode at b4 okay so mean at cell b2 median at cell b3 and mode at cell B4, B4. Okay, so we have given this prompt. Okay, and we need to find using statistical functions. Okay, and we need step by step guide. Okay, directly it should not give the uh, the result. So it's giving, okay. okay. To calculate the mean, median, mode of the data in columns A and display these values in B2, B3, okay. So before that, guys, one important update, okay. As you all are aware that A is taking over the world in such a short span of time, we have seen so many layoffs, millions of jobs replaced by AA, and you don't want to get affected by this recession wave. So AA won't replace you, but the person using AA will replace. So if you want to save your job and become irreplaceable in your career, join our three hours AI workshop in which we will teach you about the best AI tools to upskill, increase your productivity and enhance your career. All the installation steps and other AI tools will be explained detail in our B10X program. So make your future secure with us. 
and join our workshop by clicking the link below in the description okay so you have, you should go over here this is the btnx link okay and uh, you can see what about the workshops here okay you can know all the details over here and what are the workshops okay you, you should go over here whichever thing okay and uh, you should click the register now it will take you when will be the next workshop and uh, what you will learn in this workshop okay so all these details are here so don't miss it okay guys okay so we got these things okay so it is giving we need to find the median um, uh, mean median mode in the b2 b3 b4 right so it is giving this is the formula type the formula go to b2 this is the b2 and i'm taking the formula yes. I will explain how this 22.14 it came right it, you should know right i will we will ask chat gpt how the how it, it uh, calculated okay it is simple the same way you can try for all other uh, formulas also and median okay i am going to go to cell b3 you can a2 to a8 right so we are giving here and same for b4 okay mode is equal to and it is given right like if you are using old version then otherwise like, yeah. twenty. So you can use other way also okay so this is like this we have calculated if you go here right uh, formulas more functions statistics is there right that also you can check uh, chat gpt okay how to find like that so mean is nothing but average right so i'm giving average okay it will ask what are the cells i'm going from here to i'm dragging or these are the cells okay it's the same we got same for median and the same for mode so you can try out that also because this is through the excel formula and this is through the functions you need to go over here and uh, like same for there are a lot of uh, operation i mean functions here you can try out and then you can get it and uh, so like this is for median and that is for mode you can check it this is the median over here and that is the mode over here okay and now we got this uh, result actually okay but uh, how to come this is right or wrong we need to find it manually also right so for that uh, we can ask the chat gpt the mean of the values in column is approximately the calculations it has calculated okay in addition to that it has given the calculation also so 22.14 and next two things are 20 and 20 okay now we will ask chat gpt a like we can ask explain how the calculations were performed step by step okay this is essential see Okay, so the mean is calculated by summing all the values in a set and divided by the count of the value. So A2 to A8, okay. So it is given A2, A3. It's the sum of all values from A2 to A8 and the number of values. So that is average, right? In the statistics, they will tell us mean. Okay, median. Okay, median is, uh, we will ask. Okay. Yeah. So median is, is the middle of the value of a list of numbers sorted in ascending order okay if the count number is odd the median is the middle number if the count number is even the median is the average of the two middle numbers okay so we will add the two numbers and divide so that we will come to know what is the median mode means usually if it will if it is a categorical data if it is not a numerical if it's a true false or a male female 
because how many number of males we need to count okay so at that time of uh, uh, scenarios we can use this more okay so these are the things the value most frequently mode means most frequently uh, occurred in a data set mostly in categorical data sets they will use okay and see like raw data mean calculation okay how they have calculated mean nothing but it is an average we have given the same values 10 plus 15 plus 20 all calculated and divided by someone that is the 22.14 that's what v2 got here right 22.14 the next is median okay since 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 okay so this will be the median okay so that's what it is doing the fourth value is a sorted first it will sort it okay if it is two numbers okay if it is eight if there are eight values this number and the next number it will add and divided by two that value will be the median okay and mode mode is the most frequently occurred value in your data the 20 appears twice so it is mode okay so this is the way guys so the same way you can execute other operations also with the help of chat gpt you can break it out if you are not able to understand you can prompt in a way better way so that it will give you the full explanation you need not to look out for other search engine to get your result okay so i hope you enjoyed this session guys take care bye bye see you again